for Christmas. You guys are getting decorating. Uh, where we're heading, uh, we're going to have to earn the over now. We'll start to decorate. Hello boys and gals, Ramal Norm here. Today, I'm going to be melting at that old house site. A place I've been to many times before. But I keep some fun stuff there, so that's why I keep on going back there. You know how it is. Yeah, roughly in the same area as I was to in the last video. You know, melt that in old trails. And a few relics, you should check that video out. Anyways, I'm going to give this... Uh, this old house had uh, another shot. Hopefully I'll we'll, uh, find something good. We'll see. Anyways, see you guys at the old house side, I guess. Gotta do some bushwhacking. All right, guys. I'm in the grounds off uh, the old house site and the large garden that is uh, by it. Been here many times, found a lot of stuff here. Hopefully the same can be said about today. Oh, I can hear iron. All right, guys, I finally found my first decent-ish find. Been going around for like a half hour and not found anything, but uh, they find this like small orange hill. Well, I had to dig for that too. Man, oh man, it was, it's hard work detecting sometimes. But yeah, here it is, guys. It's a, it's a orange hill. Found a good man of these. Old fashioned boot. Not bad. Limbs. Oh, well, well, well. And I find anything good so far. This is kind of disappointing. Huh. Usually be some sort of foxhole, perhaps. You guys see anything in there? Hey guys, so I'm back. This is a few days later. And uh, the weather that uh, we experienced since then was rain, snow. The weather sucks. And then rain. And then today is like a drizzle. But it's also like extremely mild. It's like a I don't know, 11 or 12 degrees out. Well, at least it melted the snow. Well, snow didn't last time to begin with. Anyway, I'm going to be melting the, the main trail here today. Hopefully, I have better luck than uh, melting that house site, which is looking in that direction. Yeah, there's a couple of house sites in this uh, area, by the way. I've been here many, many times. I might have to explain that again. I've already explained that many, many times before. But, anyways, uh, yeah, I'm gonna take the main trail. Let's see what I can find. All right, guys, I don't know what it is with roots, but I got a pretty decent signal underneath it. And so the, I got it out anyway. And uh, well, I see it. Appears to be a horse cell stud or something. A stud, anyway. So there's no trouble to tell that this trail been used a long time ago. Well, yeah, that's what it is. I haven't got many of these before in the past. But I think, uh, I don't know if it's in here to get the lead around it or not. I think it does. Or it could be just dirt, I'm not sure. But anyway, not too bad of a find. Alright guys, 
Got another signal underneath this root. It's kind of jumpy, so it could be trash, but I'm gonna dig it up anyways. All right, guys, I unearthed it, and correction, so it was actually bud root, or not underneath it, thankfully. And here it is. Appears to be, huh, you know what? I think that might be a, uh, an old uh, copper or brass ring. Huh, how about that, guys? Well, well, well. I don't know if there's anything written on the other side of it. Could be. Well, obviously it needs to be cleaned up. Jeez, how cool is that? An old brass or copper ring. At least that's what it appears to be. Huh, hey look, a pair of gloves. It's lined around the pet. That reminds me. You should always wear gloves while you're detecting. Because you never know if the hole that you're doing might have glass in it. And uh, you could end up cutting yourself if you don't wear gloves. So, yeah, just a little tip. Well, guys, it's pretty peaceful in the woods today. Well, you know you're on an old trail when there's old porcelain pieces lying about. This tree was probably a mere sapling when this place was one big garden. Now it's just really grown over. And also, I like to uh, note, check out those stones. Look at the way they're uh, positioned. I think they were put there like that. Don't know when, of course, but eh, interesting. Man, that is an old tree, though. Well, guys, I had to uh, dig deep for this signal. Oh, man. All right, this thing is written up 90s on simplex. It's down here. I say that was about, I don't know, a bit of foot, maybe? Nine inches. Check that out. Mystery relic. Definitely a piece of something, but I don't know what. If you guys know what it is, let me know in the comments down below. Of course, uh, yeah. Not bad. One of the deepest relics I ever dug up. That was not like axe head or iron. Pretty cool. Whatever it is. Well, boys and gals, I get pretty tired now. I'm also pretty hungry. It's uh, around lunchtime, so uh, I'm gonna call it a day. And you know what? I gotta say, it's been a pretty good hunt. Got a few more relics in this uh, location. And I dare say there's many more to be found yet. Maybe a few coins, who knows? Many. <sighs> Anyways, guys, I uh, hope you all liked the video. If you did, Hit that lovely like button, and if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell icon up above so you don't miss another random on norm video. And leave a comment down below if you feel like it. Also check out my Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok pages. And as always, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. So, so long, and have a great and fantastic day. <sighs>
man, you know what? Mount that is pretty good exercise too. Yeah. I love this spot. Too bad it's really grown over though. Like I said, this used to be a one big garden or field way back in the day. Eight, uh, late 1800s to early 1900s, I'd say. Eh, might be back here again soon. Maybe with Johnny again. Uh, who knows? We'll see. Maybe I'll find another location or maybe I'll do like an exploration video. I'll think of something. Uh, anyway, guys. Later.